No, it didn't. Because I was fuckin' dwarf with my light out. Believe me when you get older you'll understand. [laughs] You target him and keep him within range of my arrows. Oh, you're so pretty! Excellent. Oh you're so pretty. Oh, you jerk. [noise] I hope he kills Zelda. No offense, no offense to all you Zelda fans, but seriously, I'm a Link fan. Yeah. Like Zelda is always so like Please! I'm a Link fan. Link will always rule. Link rules way more than Ganondorf, Zelda, or anything. Come on, get him, Rage. Shit. [noise] Shoot him. Gosh darn it, Gus. Aim, would ya? Oh. Aim for Pete's sake. And then fire. [laughs] [laughs] It's kind of hard for you to keep the magic on, it's about that. [noise] Oh, that did not take long. I love his horse. Yeah. Actually, I have to say his horse, like I love Epona and everything, but his looks so much cooler. Yes. Not fair. But cuz they make Kelowna look a little cooler. Like, my gosh, it's a big improvement. Crap, I need the cheese grater too and I kinda know what to do with the cheese whey. No, wait. You know what, I've never actually done beating Ganondorf in my normal tunic. I've always done it with my red armor one. Then do it with your tunic. I am gonna try it with my tunic this time. An impressive looking blade, but nothing more. Yes. Would you hear my desire? To take this battle blade and use it to blot out the light forever. What happened was, he got stabbed by that blade right in the sh- shoulder. Oh, no. Princess, you're supposed to fall off the horse, not stay on the horse. Oh, let go of the reins. She is not your horse. Let go. Oh, gosh darn it. I'm gonna die. Oh, not without my tunic. [laughs] Okay, put on the golden tunic then. No. [laughs] [laughs] Woah, you didn't hurt you at all. Cuz I raised my shield. Oh, did you see that? Yes. That never happens when I wear the other tunic. Yeah. Yeah, put it on. Oh, okay, that was so cheap shot. Put on your other tunic. No, I'll be fine. I have fairy. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Ow. Fairies are kinda cheap. No offense. What? Fairies are kind of cheap. Oh, come on. Everyone uses them. No, I'm not saying that they're not cheap but Hey, in this battle you need them. Oh, come on. Cheap. That was a freak shot. [laughs] Where'd he go? He kicks you. That's cheap. [laughs] Oh, that was so awesome. [laughs] Oh, we're getting there, we're getting there. Oh, wow, this is gonna be a first. Oh, oh, maybe I won't have to use a fairy too. Ow. Oh, crap. [noise] That's why you that's why you're never supposed to be close. Ow. Jerk. He's not paying attention. This is great [laughs] He's not paying attention to his surroundings at all. Sure. Why not? Cuz it's so interesting. You'd think he would like kick you or something and try and not make you go to the back. Just jump. Now s- just jump and slash. [noise] [laughs] 
he was going on his hands and knees, we might have a loser. I don't know how I did that, but okay. It kind of looks. Are there skulls around the place? Yeah. Where did they come from? Out of curiosity. Seriously. There's all these pots around for your health. I know, but why skulls? Well, it is the Ganondorf battle, so. Oh, ow! You I can't the wall. You can't touch the wall, you die. I mean, get hurt. Oh, oh, you did not taunt me. He taunted me. Well, then do something about it. I am. No one taunts me and gets away with it. You're dying. Here and now. Come on. Oh, he's starting to drop his guard there. He's not dead yet until Zant gets a hold of him. Oh, I like the Zant part. Why does Zant do that? Because he wants revenge. Why? What did he do? Did he kill him? Ganondorf just used him. Ganondorf kind of just, you know, like, um, how can I put this? Okay. Do not think that this ends here. He never dies. I know. The history of light and shadow will be written in blood. One second, before... Just tell me how he know. used them. How he used them? Yeah. Well, he used Zant to take over Hyrule Castle. It was Zant who invaded the castle. Yeah, and I know that. After Zant left, like he didn't want the castle. He just did this because he wanted power. Oh, Zant hurt. Watch everybody. I love how his eyes go. They roll up in his head. I love it. Okay. One ways, why does he do that? Cause he took because, some. Of his like he he doesn't want the castle. He wants Twilight. So I guess I don't know. Maybe they made a deal saying that hey, if you take Hyrule Castle for me, I'll give you the Twilight Crown. You know what I mean? But um, either way, Zant was just a useless pawn. He wasn't an actual ally to Ganondorf. Ganondorf never has any allies. He's a lying, cheating, snob.